Go to the Knowledge Base by clicking on Modules, Knowledge Management, and Knowledge Base Explorer. Here, you can structure your knowledge base in many different ways. You have the overall start page, which contains all the headers, also known as parents, of your knowledge base's hierarchy. Those are marked with bold text. These act as natural headers and are usually empty as they are used to build the hierarchy. The arrow on the left illustrates that there is a deeper level which you can unfold by clicking on it. The hierarchy ends when there are no more arrows presented. When structuring the knowledge base, construct it in a way that makes sense to you and your end users. Whenever you are hovering over a knowledge item and want to add something, simply click on Create, and Knowledge Item. The new item will automatically be grouped under the current item. Also, it inherits all the setting, therefore making it easier to structure your knowledge base. If you turn to the self-service portal, note that the user can only see two layers of the knowledge base and should click through the rest of the knowledge items.